Our GMA cover story and an alarming new study showing a high number of teen girls report using different diet pills and laxatives. ABC News medical correspondent Dr. Darian Sutton is here with more on this. Good morning to you. Uh, this really is an alarming trend here. So break down the latest research. What are we learning? It's an alarming trend. It's concerning and honestly medically frightening. So in this study, it's a large study, over 600,000 participants. And with they found that one in 10 adolescent females are uh, having using some sort of a diet supplement, uh, a laxative or in a, um, excuse me, a a diet supplement, a laxative, or a diuretic, which is incredibly concerning because not only can it have medical effects, but it can have lasting psychological effects. And so you talked about some of the concerns, but obviously, you know, people use these medications for a reason. Yeah. What is the concern if they're using it for the wrong reason? So there are acute reasons why you don't you want to avoid these. Number one, electrolyte abnormalities. I see them in the emergency room. The symptoms can have a variety of different causes, or excuse me, different signs that can lead to just feeling unwell, but also to abnormal heart rhythms. And then if you're having a constant use of a laxative, that can lead you to chronic constipation, the type of constipation that makes you insensitive to laxatives and it can damage your colon permanently. So I'm a parent. Uh, and for all the parents out there, what are the red flags, the warning signs um, to know that, you know, your child might be struggling with something? When we talk about warning signs, we're going to talk about disordered eating and eating disorders. Now, the line between these two can be blurred. So disordered eating focuses more on the habits that we have around eating. That can include things like over-exercising, too much focus on food, comments about your weight. And then when you want to talk about eating disorders, that can include extreme restrictive eating, extreme picky eating, binge eating, or physical signs like calluses on the knuckles or damage to the enamel or a patient having GI symptoms without a known cause. The bottom line is if you notice any of these signs or symptoms, you should start a conversation and seek out professional assistance. Really important information. Dr. Darian, thank you so much as always. And of course, we want to remind people, if you are experiencing any mental health crisis, please call or text the 988 Suicide and Crisis Lifeline. Thank you again, doctor. We appreciate it. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.